Victor Wembanyama has been incredible this season. He's averaging over 20 points, 10 rebounds, 3.5 assists, a steal, and leading the league with 3.5 blocks per game, while also making 1.7 threes per game. That combination of averages has never happened before in NBA history. Victor Wembanyama is doing it right now as a rookie who just turned 20 years old. And he's also just doing things we've never seen before. Watch as he makes NBA players just look helpless on both sides of the floor in this sequence. Blocked by Victor. <laughs> There's be another word for that one. Oh, oh. destroyed. Oh, oh, mama. Talk about destroyed. Victor Wembanyama. He's clearly the rookie of the year. Some major sports books aren't even taking bets on the award anymore. It's hard to imagine that he'll only get better from here, even though he's already proving to be one of the most impactful players in the league on both sides of the ball. He can still get a lot better. But could Wembanyama also be the NBA's Defensive Player of the Year? He's leading the NBA with three and a half blocks per game, one whole block ahead of number two right now. His ability to turn away and alter shots is already the best in the league. In addition to his top-level block numbers, he's also adding 1.3 steals per game. Only six players have ever averaged at least 3.5 blocks and 1.3 steals in a season. He's also deflecting three passes per game, which ranks eighth in the NBA. All of that together means about eight times a game NBA players are attempting shots, passes, and dribble moves that Wembenyama just ruins. He's a disruptive defensive force all on his own. And force is the right word to use to describe Wembenyama's impact on the Spurs' defense. When he's on the court, the Spurs' defense is 12 points per 100 possessions better. The Spurs allow 112.5 points per 100 possessions when Wembenyama is on the court. That would be the seventh best defense in the NBA. When he's off the court, their defense allows 124.5 points per 100 possessions, which would rank last in the NBA by three whole points. The Spurs' defense is basically elite when he plays and garbage when he doesn't. It's undeniable that Victor Wembanyama has an insane influence on the Spurs' defense and is already one of the most impactful defenders in the NBA. But how does he stack up against the other Defensive Player of the Year candidates? Most sportsbooks have Wembanyama in contention with Rudy Gobert, Jarrett Allen, Bam Adebayo, and Anthony Davis for the award. Wemby is leading every player in steals, blocks, and deflections per game, while also having the biggest impact on his team's defensive rating when he's on the court. Anthony Davis is the only other contender averaging at least two blocks, one steal, and two deflections per game, but the Lakers are actually one and a half points per 100 possessions better defensively when he's not on the court this season. That stat isn't the whole story, but the difference between Wemby and AD's impact is apparent. These are some of the best defenders in the NBA and Wembenyama not only matches up with them, but he's already proving to be better than them. Now let's check out some plays that show why Victor Wembenyama is such a good defender and deserves to win the Defensive Player of the Year award. The Spurs game against the Bucks earlier in the year was a big moment for Wembenyama. Late in the game, he had Giannis choosing to not drive or try to post him up and take a three instead. Giannis makes the shot, but he's very efficient around the rim and only takes 1.8 threes per game and shoots under 30%, so making him take the three instead of driving is already changing the plan late in a close game for a two-time MVP. And then a little later, Wemby switches onto Giannis and the Greek freak decides to try and dunk over him, but Wembenyama sends his shot back. One of the most impressive plays we've seen from Wemby and against a former Defensive Player of the Year, no less. The screen, the drive. Oh, it's knocked away by Wembenyama. Knocked away by Wembenyama. This play on Chet Holmgren is another one of Wembenyama's great defensive plays of the season. Holmgren trying to answer. He is stuck and taken away. Places going bananas. Jones. <laughs> Wembenyama changes how players play and shoot all the time. Look how high Jakob Pertl has to throw this floater just to give it a chance. And here, Anthony Davis tries to isolate on Wemby and AD has to try a spinning reverse on the opposite side of the rim, but Victor sends it away. Carl Anthony Towns also tries to barrel his way into the lane, but Wembenyama alters his entire shot attempt. McDermott got switched out on him. Now Towns. Winds his way through, but couldn't finish. 
Wembenyama isn't just a big rim protector. He can also step out and defend guards and wings on switches like he does here against Scotty Barnes. Now Barnes gets turned. Tries to get physical again, just in no man's no. land. No. Twice rejected by Wembenyama. That's seven blocks now for Victor. And Champagny will get the finish at the other end. Against the Lakers here, he guards Russell and Prince on the same play and makes the shot very difficult. The Lakers now in a little bit of trouble. Torian Prince has to go high off the arc to avoid Victor, can't get the roll. On this play, Victor slides over to help on Hachimura, turns around to deny Jackson Hayes, and then follows LeBron down the baseline and swats his fadeaway shot. The play was reviewed and deemed a block. That's a block, Dan. He catches the ball first and then, yes, there's contact on the hand, but there's the block. That's a block shot. And here's another example where Wemby switches on to Anthony Edwards. Three there just catches McDaniels trying to cheat over the top of Victor's screen. Works into that fadeaway jumper. Edwards tried to get the high bounce pass to Gobert, but he was already setting up for a possible rebound. But he left his feet and Victor with a great contest. Edwards. There may be no better help defender in the NBA than Victor Wembanyama this season. His ability to cover ground and block shots is unlike any other player in the league. On this play, Wemby is on the opposite side of the paint when Kyle Anderson starts his shot attempt and Wemby still blocks it out of the air. Blocked by Wemby! Underneath, Gobert. Oh, he couldn't finish! And Wemby comes away with it. Spurs a chance to tie with a three. And don't even try a corner three against him. Open in the corner. Oh, that's a nice lock. Rim Banyama deflection a block by him. His 30 averages three a game. Another underrated part of Wembenyama's game is his ability to rebound and finish defensive plays. Only five players average more defensive rebounds per 36 minutes than he does. Victor Wembenyama is an insanely impactful defender is putting up incredibly unmatched defensive numbers, stands out above his competition, and is doing things no one else can do on the defensive end this season. He deserves to win the Defensive Player of the Year award.